Since the announcement of Apple's AR kit in June, developers have been hard at work producing apps to take advantage of iOS 11's AR features. iOS 11 has finally been released to the public, and many are very curious to try out some AR apps for themselves. Apple Insider offers you a look at some of the best augmented reality apps you can test out right now. If you haven't already installed iOS 11, go to Settings, General, then Software Update. There you'll see iOS 11 available and ready to download and install. ARKit is limited to the A9 and newer processor, meaning that the iPhone 6S, SE, 7 and 8 families can use the technology. For iPads, you'll need either an iPad Pro or a 2017 iPad. And of course, the upcoming iPhone 10 will also work. Here's some of the best ARKit apps currently available on the App Store. Let's start with SkyGuide, which automatically finds constellations, planets, satellites, and more when you point your phone at the sky, except now it shows it all in augmented reality. This app is priced at $2.99. IKEA has just released their new IKEA Place app, which uses ARKit to place 3D virtual models of furniture onto floors and other services in a house in real time, with an accurate representation of size, so you can get a preview of what certain items would look like before committing to a purchase. The app offers prices and direct links to instantly purchase the item from their online store. A similar app called Housecraft instead lets you choose from a variety of furniture instead of being limited to IKEA furniture. You can also resize objects to specific dimensions, which is useful if you have your eye on a specific piece of furniture and want to see how it'll fit and look in a room. There's an app called Measure Kit, which can do things like measure distances between objects, check angles, check a person's height, and check if something is perfectly level. Those features require a one-time payment of $2.99, but you get the ruler feature for free, which is useful if you don't have a tape measure handy. Another app is called Planar, which uses ARKit to gather room measurements. The app scans and detects your floor and lets you set points on each corner and entry, and later labeling doors and entries, allowing you to view square footage and share the completed floor plan. There's a similar app called Tap Measure, which works like Planar except it allows you to set ceiling height and outline features like windows and paintings. You can then view it in 3D and in a bird's eye view. It even offers CAD file export, but for a price. You can also measure items like tabletops and check if objects like paintings are level. There's a new ARK app named Fitness AR and is designed to visualize rides, runs, and hikes on a 3D map which can be viewed on a table or other flat surface. Fitness AR will display the log data to show you a bird's eye view of your path, also allowing you to explore and find new trails, but you'll need to pay $2.99 for the app. Another app that utilizes iOS 11's AR kit is Carrot Weather, which can display the weather and other info on a flat surface, but it costs $3.99. An interesting app is called Edmunds, which has a new feature called Can It Fit? This app lets you preview various cards in a space to see if it fits in your parking space or garage. Moving on to more fun options, there's Giphy World, which lets you place floating GIFs around a room, even allowing you to share entire scenes with friends who have the app, and it's all for free. A similar app is called Orb, except it lets you place geometric objects instead of GIFs. There's also a couple games, like Splitter Critters, which is a puzzle platformer that can appear as a box on a flat surface, allowing you to swipe to interact with the game, but it'll cost you $2.99. Thomas & Friends Minis is an AR app that was featured in the App Store, which lets you design tracks for Thomas the Tank Engine to run on. It's very simple, but can be a ton of fun for kids. My Very Hungry Caterpillar AR is essentially the original book, but brought to life in the real world, which costs $2.99. There's also a simple game called Stack AR, which basically lets you stack blocks on the floor or flat surface. Another one is Euclidean Lands, which is a strategy game similar to Monument Valley but you can play the game in any wide open space, priced at $3.99. There are even painting apps like World Brush, which lets you draw 3D shapes and designs in the real world. The apps are saved at the approximate GPS location where it was created, so others can go and view drawings made by other users. We'll have links to each app in the video description so you can download and check them out. If you enjoyed this video, like it and hit that subscribe button. Also, check out our price guide, which makes it extremely easy to find the best deals on Apple products updated daily. Be sure to follow us on social media and we'll see you in the next video.